Diddy Kong Racing! Hey, Internet! Welcome back to Diddy Kong Racing for... Wow, that was a great intro. I couldn't even say my own name. I'm Colorful Artie, the guy who forgets how to talk multiple times during a given video. You're in the right place if that's the kind of entertainment you're looking for. So, we need to do the Silver Coin Challenges in Sherwood Island today. We're going to give Banjo another try. I'm banjo! I like Banjo. And also, an important thing I'm going to do... I'm going to keep a copy of my game, just in case I forget to record something or something corrupt. Alright. Give me a hovercraft. Banjo is quite skilled in a hovercraft. He looks weird, though. If you compare Banjo in this to Banjo in his actual games, he looks very different in this. I love how hover like, hitting a wall with a hovercraft at the right angle like propels you forward. It's a nice little trick you can do. Alright, so let's try oh, let's start with Pirate Lagoon. I love this course. Pirate Lagoon. Silver coin challenge. So this is this is the world where the purple coin challenge is. Did I- how long have I been saying purple coin? The silver coin challenges get a bit more tricky in this world. Funny thing is I haven't even played Super Mario Galaxy in a while. <laughs> Come on, Banjo. Hopping too much around a corner, though, does make your hovercraft slow down greatly. There. All right, we almost have all the silver coins. This is great. Last one's over here. I don't. I love that sound effect. I don't know why it's a banjo sound effect, but I will take it. Woo! Nice going, banjo. Now accelerate again, please. Banjo, do not pollute the water, please. That's really going to come back to bite you. Foreshadowing! Woo! Yeah, you don't need the boost to get over there. Woohoo! Pirate Lagoon! Love the pirate, the nautical theme. And the fort that you drive through, that's a nice touch as well. Alright, let's try. Whale Bay. It's another hovercraft Whale level. Bay. Banjo should be good at that. Hey, look, I spy a coin. And everyone pushed me away from it. That's nice of them. This is such a small course that the coins are kind of clumped together. I know for a fact there's one on top of the whale. Wait, what? There's not? <laughs> Whoa! Give me that. Maybe there's just all... One area. Oh, you can act those are solid? Oh no. Banjo is stinking. There's the last one. Uh-oh, Diddy Cone has a very nice lead. Move a drumstick. There's a bear and a bird coming through here, and you don't want to get in his way. I gotta take the whale shortcut. It's my only chance. Stupid whale! Thank you, you're not stupid. Yeah, Banjo! Nice! Alright, Banjo is going to take a crack at the treasure caves. Treasure 
So I'm going to start the first lap like I did on the regular playthrough. <laughs> I'm going to just eat as many bananas as I can. Take that, Conker. Move it, Crunch. You're not supposed to be in this far ahead. TT, on the other hand, now that makes sense. Let me catch up to first place. Admittedly, it helps to be a character with good turning on this level for the Silver Coin Challenge. But Banjo will have to make do. Thank you, large hitboxes. Oh, I hit that! Aww. Well, the tap trick will help. Move it, did he call him? No! Shoot, 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 shoot! I don't think I can win now. No. Banjo. Okay, kids, when you're doing the Silver Coin Challenge, do not be Banjo on this level. Out of the way, guys. I'm getting that first lap so I don't forget later. Banjo, why are you getting stuck on every single wall? How come Drumstick and Pipsy are in last? They're like two of the better characters in the game. Yeah, Primordial Ooze, that's not good. Move it, Bum Bum. Watch out, Banjo's coming through. Gotta catch up. Yes! Come on, come on, beat you! Win, 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 yes! <laughs> Thank you, Tap A Trick. Oh, that was amazing. <laughs> Alright, well, as fun as it has been being Banjo, it's time to switch characters again. Timber honks his horn once. Taj comes over. Timber's so cute. And yet, he already owns his own island. He's doing well. Alright. Crescent Island. I'm sorry, Christmas Island. Love this level. So that's two coins right off the bat. There's one back here. All with some bananas. Alright, that was one there. That's a bit trickier to get. Also, there's one up here. But at least I got some bananas in the process. One in the shortcut. Alright, Conquer. Da 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 da. See every silver coin down here somewhere? Now it's right there. Cool. Dane Timber, you are good. No one's catching this crazy cat. 
No one is catching me. Look at this lead! I'm going towards the fin of the dolphin and everyone else is still on the back. Finish! From Finland. Alright, it's time for rematch against the alcohol monster. Diddy Kong the Racing, rated KA for alcohol reference. Alcohol! All right, doofus. <laughs> Let's do this. This is where he goes no holds barred. Wait till you see him. So now he drops bubbles. I haven't seen those yet. But he drops a lot of them. And if you hit one, that happens. He's also quite fast now, so... Catch 22. Shoot that at him. Aw, oh, that should have hit him. <laughs> yep, that one pop pops after about a second. Thankfully. Yes! In first, alright. Much like his first race, if you get in first, it's very hard to lose your uh, position. Because there's really nothing you can do to slow yourself down. And that is how you beat an octopus with an alcohol problem. That was a close race, though. He actually crossed the finish line. Well done, Shrimp. You have earned a piece of the ambulance. Now I'll try the trophy challenge. Goodbye. Uh, thanks, dude. I can't believe we are done with Sherbet Island. Actually, we're not done with Sherbet Island. We still need to get the key. Just one more piece of the amulet left. Soon you will be ready for Wizpig. You can do it! Wizpig is the bad guy, in case you didn't know. It's kind of unclear. Alright, so you're probably wondering where the key is. So if you're like me, you're probably guessing it's on the treasure caves, since there are tons of caves that we did couldn't explore because we were in a car. Or maybe Pirate Lagoon somewhere. Or perhaps Whale Bay. No, it's Crescent Island. It's on Crescent Island. And kind of a lame place, to be perfectly honest. So where you want to go, you're going to want to be a hovercraft on this level. So you go in the water. Yep, see that down there? There's a hole in this cave with a key inside. Thus far, all three of the keys have been in kind of lame hiding spots. I guess the Snowflake Mountain one wasn't super lame. Well, the next world, it's in an amazing spot, so don't worry. I like exploring levels and finding hidden stuff. It's fun. Alright. Time for this minigame. Darkwater Beach. The last player remaining will win. So it's basically Icicle Pyramid, just different map. And you're in Hovercraft. Why am I always going against Diddy Kong? Literally always. <laughs> so that's one of the ways that the logs can be irritating. Also, because you're in Hovercrafts, which are way less precise, you pretty much need to use homing missiles. Do 
Okay, tip top. Okay, where's TT? He's been out of the action for too long. Bye, Tip Top. <laughs> I literally, like, blew him up. Alright, where is that clock? That's Diddy Call, not the clock. Hey, TT, it's time to say goodbye. <laughs> this is a very well-designed map. A lot of overlap and underlap, but there's still plenty of area for a wide-open fight. You took away my perfect victory! Those who take away my perfect victory get blasted to kingdom come. And I don't mean the one from Dragon Tales. Where is that clock? There he is. Where you going, TT? <laughs> Didn't need the homie missile for that last one. And there you have it. <laughs> Dark Water Beach. You won first prize. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> Amazing! You now have three pieces of the TT amulet. Just one more piece to go. Good luck. Yep, we're approaching the final world. And we'll find out where and what it is in the next episode. Thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Arnie, and I hope to see you then. Have a great day, and God bless.